It is rare for a race near the bottom of the ticket to get much attention, but this year, the Lexington Coroner's race could end up being tight. Bodie Brooks sat down with the challenger hoping to unseat the current coroner. It's a service that is needed. It's not a job most would want to do, but someone has to direct the death investigations of the community, and that is the coroner. For two decades, Gary Ginn has served Lexington. I've been working with deceased individuals for 47 years. Larry Owens is a paramedic with a background in firefighting, the Department of Corrections, and multiple coroner's offices. He's running because he believes something is missing from current leadership. To restore the uh, professionalism, the compassion, the transparency, um, that's need, so, uh, sorely needed in the office. Owens points to bad headlines that have dogged the current coroner. Starting in 2015 at UK's body bequeathal program, more than 200 cremated remains were found unburied. Then came sexual harassment accusations that a judge later dropped. The most recent incident involves a Lexington family whose son died out of state in a skiing accident. A deputy coroner left the family a note with little explanation. The way the notification was handled was completely opposite from, from the way that I was trained, that other coroners I've worked with and spoken with, the way that we were trained. The incident led to the creation of Nathan's Law, requiring additional annual grief training. In an unrelated interview, Ginn spoke with us earlier this month on his office's training. I make it mandatory that they have to have so much school, uh, some related training. Uh, a lot of different things go into it. One thing that I'm very, very proud of is the fact that um, I and my entire staff are certified death investigators through the American Board of Medical Legal Death Investigators. Bodie Brooks, Fox 56 News. On Thursday, we'll sit down with current coroner Gary Ginn to talk about why he believes voters should give him another four years on the job.